What's going on everybody? This is Al from PlayBookGamer.com and in the last Dynasty video we went through our preseason for season three. We looked at our schedule, we done some red shirting, a little recruiting, we set up our roster and now we're ready to play our first game of the season which is today and that is against Colorado. It's been a while since I played them. I, from what I remember I think they run like a pro style offense with a 4-3 defense. Looks like they got the same amount of talent as we do. They've already played a game, they lost to who knows uh, who that was, but you look at some of their stats, you know, after one game, you really can't judge too much, but it looks like they play decent defense, at least, but either way, it should be a whole lot of fun, hopefully we can get our first win of the season to kick off the season right, but before we do that, we got to look at a few things. Let's go to end season recruiting. In the past video, I mentioned that I was going to make a couple changes with the recruiting board. Before, I was going after six players, now I'm only going to go after five. And another change is I've switched up a couple of guys. The main one is I was going after the Texas corner, Ben Harrell. He's a little faster and a little more athletic than Richard, the corner that is local. However, Richard is much smarter and he's much stronger. I think those features uh, long term and on a play by play basis will help us out a whole lot more than seeing uh, one of these guys occasionally just swat a ball down, if that makes sense. I think long-term, this guy could be a better player for us. Now, I'm already down to the very bottom on his list, and that's just because we didn't put any points on him in that last week because I was going after Harold. So what I've decided to do was I'm going to dump 25 points into McDonald. I did have 20. I'm going with 25. we got to make sure we get this kid. He is a day-one starter for us next season. If he comes, at least I think he would be. And that's our green light position because we got an All-American out of that position a couple of seasons ago. So for now, I'm going to put 25 on him. Hopefully, the sooner he'll uh, ready to take a visit, the better we can use those points on somebody else. But I got to put 25 on Richard because we lost a week and we're dead at the bottom of his list. I'd like to think after today, win or loss, we will uh, move up his list because we're putting a fourth of our percentage points on him. So I took the points off of Harrell, and I also took the points off of Tidwell. I had to sacrifice somewhere. I, I prefer to go to five players or less and not six. Six is a little too thin for me until you get, like, so good, you know, six-star program prestige where you can recruit whoever you want, but we're not there yet. But we're going to go after Hall. I, we need a middle linebacker more than we need an outside linebacker. You can tell we got a ton of outside linebackers. I don't need a sixth one coming uh, in next year. So we're going to go after Hall. We're going to go after Larson. I think this guy's a, a future stud and halfback for us. I'm really excited about him. You look at his uh, attributes, all really good stuff, and I love it. Excited to see if he can come to our school and do some good things for us. And we're also going to go after the three-star right tackle, Aaron Johnson. He's big. He's strong. He fits exactly what I'm looking for. And we're number one on his list. So we're in good shape for all of these except for oh, – for Richard, only because we didn't even recruit him last week. But hopefully that'll change with those extra points. Other than that, there's nothing else to look at. Uh, Sports Illustrated, there's only been one week played, and there's just not a whole lot going on so far. So let's just go ahead into the game, and let's check out their uniforms and see what we got. So that's their default. I like that. Do they have an alternate? They can go all white. Uh, do they got anything else? Oh, that is their home, I guess. We're going to go with their default away. And we're going to look at ours, and we're going to go with that. I think that's a good compliment to their black pants and their white jersey. All right. Should be a lot of fun. It's been like a week since I've got to play an actual game. We've been doing off-season and preseason stuff, so that kind of takes some time, you know, to get through all that before you can actually start playing some games. But here we are. We finally get to do so, and I'm really excited about that. Um, should be a whole lot of fun. All right. Looks like we actually may have some weather at home. This is the first rain game we've ever had. We'll see if that affects... Oh, yeah, heavy rain. We'll see if that affects turnovers, fumbles, and such. It's going to be hot as well. That'll be interesting to see how that plays into things. This is a Big 12 matchup. You know, anybody who's keeping up with college football and the conference realignment, Colorado's in the Big 12. Arizona's in the Big 12. Arizona State. And Utah. Just going to be pretty wild. So they're going to highlight Paul Rhodes. I hope and I pray he just takes over that position and does some amazing things. He's too talented not to. 
We'll see how that goes. They're going to pick us to win. Let's go to the coin toss. Let's see what we got here. Looks like we won it. I want the ball to start the second half. That's always my preference. And let's go to our roster first. The first thing, we've already went through our depth chart. Nothing has changed there since that previous video. I need to go to formation sub. So here's what we're going to do. You know we got our third string quarterback, who's that Juco speedster in Burks, as you see right here. He's got 76 speed. I'm going to give him two formations. I'm going to give him this formation. We got some decent option plays in this formation. And I like to run. We're going to do basic option with him, by the way. We're going to put him there, and I'm going to put him here. We're going to put him at ace tight. We only run from this formation anyways. So we're going to go right there. And when I run basic option, I tend to have a lot more success when everybody's kind of crunched in. So you can attack the outside better instead of spreading everybody out. For example, it's a little tougher to run option here than it is here because you just got more grass to play with. So we're going to give him those two right there. Next thing I'm going to do is make sure that Henry, our halfback, is where he needs to be. I'm going to put him there. I think I'm going to put him here as well. I mean, he needs to have... Uh, let's put uh, Long Bonds here. He needs to have a lot of touches. He's our most talented player. Uh, here we can try Long Bonds. Uh, there. I think I may leave all that as is. We just don't have a whole lot of... I need to put Smith somewhere. I think I may put Smith right here because we don't use this formation too often. Other than that, I think we're okay everywhere else. Now, one other thing I want to check with wide receiver... We got three speedy guys, so I think we're going to be fine regardless of who we put out there. I was about to put Thomas in one of the bigger sets. We can run some triple wide receiver stuff. I don't think we're going to need to. All three of those guys are about equally fast. So let's go back to formation subs. I think I am done with the formation subs on offense. There's really nothing else I need to do here. It was just quarterback and halfbacks type stuff, and that's just an easier way for me to uh, put guys in what I have without having to do sub packages and getting out of the menu all the time. What we need to do is go to defense, and we need to check and make sure our linebackers are who they need to be. Starting off, I want Palmer there, and I've got to make sure Krogstad is there. On Dime, just want to make sure Krogstad is there as well. The last thing we need to look at is special teams return block. I need to have the fastest guys I can think of right here. So we got the Loach on one end, which is good. He's our fastest player. And then we have Kaysen, who's got a 92 speed. We could probably put Singleton there. I don't... 93 speed, 92 speed. I don't know if it's really going to matter. We can do something like that, perhaps. All right, so we're done with the formation subs. Let's go over to Dev Chart and check out their roster. Starting off, quarterback, Bernard Jackson, 84 speed. This will be a nightmare to deal with. Uh, hopefully, we can contain him some today. And they got an impact halfback. Thankfully, it's not this guy. So this is kind of goofy. They got an impact status on the backup halfback who is 10 points less than the starter at 92. It just It's really no different than our fullback impact player status. It's just kind of goofy. Uh, but either way, hopefully this guy doesn't play a ton, but I'm sure he will. Uh, either way, an amazing backfield. Not much of fullback. Wide receiver, 90, 85, 82, 80. A really good-looking wide receiver core. You look at tight end. Not a bad starter. 84, 72 speed. He can catch pretty well. So they got some playmakers on their team. You look at their offensive line. 82, 80, 87, 78, and 84. Not bad for the Big 12, I guess. Uh, but I like our front four a little bit more than their offensive line. We'll see if we can take advantage of that. Again, I think they run a 4-3. You got 80 and 87 on the edges not bad defensive tackle just 80 and 80 and it's a kind of a drop off from there we may want to run more dive and such i'll try not to forget that uh i know our interior line is not the best in the world but theirs isn't either so we'll see what we can do linebackers 89 80 and 97 wow 90 this may be the best linebacker we'll face all season look at that speed 87 that's incredibly fast for an outside linebacker. So their linebacker unit is pretty good, especially on the edges. Let's look at their corners. Not all the best in the world, but unfortunately our biggest weakness on offense is, I guess, our passing attack. We just got some really young guys, but they don't have a whole lot of talent here. I'll try to keep that in mind. Look at their safeties. Wow, 92 overall. Then you got a 78. We're going to try to attack that guy some today if we can. Uh, kicker, 56, true freshman, awful, and a bad punter who is a sophomore. All right, let's get this show on the road. 
Love to start off this season with the win. I don't see any impact guys on the back end, so I'm going to kick it straight. And our third season of Arizona is well underway. And the first tackle of the season goes to the kicker. Pretty cool. Or I guess he's our punter. I think they're going to run quite a bit. So we're going to go with the one high. We're going to blitz our middle linebacker. Defensively, we're not going to change a whole lot to our scheme as we, from last year. I thought it was went pretty well. So we'll stick with that. Good tackle. Somebody came through, I think, as one of the defensive tackles. Second and 12. Going with the bigger set. Uh, I, just one thing I need to look at. Uh... Middle linebacker, if I went with a 4-4, four, four, would it move Palmer back over or McCovey? And who's my better safety, 85 and 82? So I think that's going to work out okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go 4-4. Four, four. Yes, they kept Palmer on the, on the outside, so they put McCovey in. We're going to go cover one. We're going to have Crockstab blitz again. And I think I may just leave it as is. Comes out with an eye formation. They're going with a toss, and they're going to get a first down. Just a good toss play. Good blocking. I wish that happened for me. I'd use it a whole lot more. Uh, we'll do another one high. Uh, we're going to flip it. Still going with a balanced set, technically. We'll bring her safety down. Hopefully it doesn't hurt us. Oh, good play up the middle. Fullback. Uh, just, yeah, good play. And I went the wrong way with the defensive tackle. First and 10. I fully expect them just to run all day. And they even have some good uh, wide receivers. But if I was them, I would just run, run, run. Oh, dang it. He picked it right back up. I was trying to get in front of it. So I played this perfectly. I've done this on purpose. Right there. Just try to get in front of it like that. And I didn't really mean to dive in front of him. That actually worked out even better. But he picked it right back up. So just a good bounce for them. Uh, they're going one high. We'll go back to, or one wide receiver. We'll do the same. We'll go 4-4. Four, four. So I may have picked a bad team to play against. They just got an incredible backfield. And there they go. Another fullback dive. They're running triple on us. Uh... I'll do a 4-3, one high. Pretty much the same thing we just did. Uh, we'll bring him down, I guess. I hope that didn't hurt us. Sometimes with those shifts, you never know. Triple. And he still gets the first down. It's just going to be a, a tough out today. <laughs> so I guess they're going to just run option a lot. I didn't know. I should have probably... Uh, scouted a little bit. If we would have made a difference. I was going to schedule them anyways, but uh, we'll do something like this. Let's see what they do here. He still gets around it. First down. Wow. We had somebody come through the backfield right there, and it still didn't matter. Oh, man. Uh, let's try one high from here. Second and less than a yard. Ball on the 13 yard line. Uh, yeah, I'm going to leave it as is. Second and short. Make a play, Krogstad. Good job. So that makes it, what, third and four or five? I'm going to go cover two, four, three. I, if I was them, I'd run the ball. We'll see if they do that. I'm going to do something like this. It wouldn't shock me. Nope, they're going to pass it. Ah, first down. Easy first down. A little drag route to the tight end. Well, let's see if we can maybe keep him out of the end zone. We may get lucky here. If anyone can uh, no, well, let's back out. I'm going to do that bad. They better block that linebacker. He is looking to make something happen. Too easy. Pull back over. So that was like the easiest touchdown ever. Drive. Just, you know, they had no issues. Not a single. I mean, we had, a, what, two stops on him maybe? The rest of it was 10-yard gash plays every time. So we'll get on offense, and we'll just try to keep up with them today. We'll need our defensive line to get better push. 
that's the PAT. But these are the hardest teams to defend, at least for me, just running hardcore running teams. If they get any type of decent blocking, you just got to hope for fumbles and such at that point. Or just try to have better talent than they do. Uh, uh, we may... I'm going to leave it as is. Okay. So what we're going to do, uh, this will be our main four mage. We're going to do a lot of weak and such. I'm going to go smash. I'm trying to get my best players out there. And my 21 personnel is about the best we have. Now let's go to the left. Ah, uh, dang it. Is that a glitch? It did not It did not mess me up in practice. But that is a glitch. Smash, don't use smash. I got to write that down. Don't, I got to pause this. Don't use smash. Don't know why it's not working. It worked just fine before and I never touched it. But now it doesn't work. So we lost the yard. Uh, we can, uh, I'm going to run the ball. I'm going to go. Let's get that Juco quarterback in there. We're going man. They got that impact guy on the right. I think I may go to the left. Arizona comes out with two tight ends. Burks options out. Nice little pitch there. Just get a first down. And they were lucky that Good play. No question, and they I'm gonna go uh, to weak slot. Let's see what I have. Uh, like never the we're gonna go flat post. I'm gonna try to run some new stuff. We're gonna go zone. Let's see what they do here. Go to the fullback, get about five yards. Make sure he gets a touch or two. Second and five, we're going to go with counter. Maybe Henry can get some yards on this one. And they're going... I'm going to go to the left. Ah, just bad play. Everybody got pushed. That makes it, what, third and six. I will probably... I don't think we can get the... I got to go deep outs. I don't think we can get the first down with something smaller or shorter. We're going man. Going cover two. And our first drop of the season. So we got to punt it. That was a good throw. That wasn't on the quarterback. That was on the receiver. So let's punt it. Not going to be the best punt. He's going to return this thing. Maybe he can get to him in time. Yeah, good deal. So we just got unlucky. We're going to have to get some luck somewhere. Let's get back on defense and maybe we can get a stop. Uh, I'm going to pinch in. I don't know if that's going to hurt or blitz her. Wide receiver play. Look at this room they got. I swear, that never works for me. And it worked perfectly for them. Jeez, I hate when that happens. It's so frustrating to see that. They're calling the goofy plays that just rarely work for you. Had no problem there, though. I'm going to do something like this. Uh, we're just going to get boat raced today. Uphill battle. That could have been much worse right there. Let's go one high. Ball on the 48. We're going to go ace and normal. The buff come out in the ace formation. Let's see what they do here. To to the Just the too easy. To Way too easy. The man, their quarterback's good. To look at him. He's not making any mistakes at the moment. Let's go cover two, man. We're going to stick with man. That's just kind of what our defense has been like all this entire dynasty. Zone ain't going to help us today with this much running. No way. Ah, dang it. He still got out of that, but good deal. So we finally got a tackle for loss. They was trying to do that halfback play. I want to do a one high. I'm going to flip it. We're going to do this. And perfect protection across the board. Gee whiz. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That's just... Already got 100 yards today. Well, it may not be for today. All right, let's keep playing more defense. Their offensive line's playing great. They're just pushing us around all day. Another option play. There he goes. Easy eight yards. 
I have no answer for it. They're going goal line. I, I'm going to try dog blitz. I assume they're going goal line. It said they was uh, play action wide open too. It's, oh well, it just uphill battle. Just going to be a long day, I'm afraid. It said they was going to cover zero and they went one wide receiver. I hate when it does that. All right, so maybe we can try to get some points on this one and keep it somewhat close. And he tacked on the extra point. But we're just getting our butt kicked. That's all it is, and there's you got no answers for it. So good job, Al, for picking Colorado on your schedule. Picked them at the worst time. They got the perfect backfield. All right, let's see if we can complete a pass. We haven't got to do that yet. Let's see if Thomas can make a play. Uh, we're here. Uh, we can go. I actually want to just run it with Henry. Except for going man nickel. At least cover one. We'll go to the left. Just nobody block. Nobody block. Like good enough. That's we got eight yards. We'll take it. I want to go. Uh, where's an at? Uh, I didn't drag. Second and two coming up here. All on their own going ball. man. This may go to Henry. Nope, they're going cover zero. Get it, get it, get it. Great catch by Marks. Great catch. They it actually got double team because of that dig route. Great play, everybody. Yeah, that's all. It's all him, though. To be honest, that may be a good thumbnail. By the way, he kind of done a little swerve here when he caught it. That's a funny one right there. I don't want to get the do something like this. That's uh, something. If I can get it up like that, that's pretty cool. That may be your thumbnail. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. Okay, keeps the drive going. We're going to go. We'll just run basic option from here. It's first and ten. Looks like they got that impact guy on that side. And he's coming down. So I may have to go this way. Go long bonds. That linebacker's super fast. Man, he's really quick. Second and two. I actually want to go play action. We're going to go PA rollout. I want to attack that strong safety. Hopefully they'll go cover two here. We'll see. Arizona. Cover two. Ah, just not a good throw. He had to come back for it and everything. Good play by the corner, too. So it's second and two. I will... We'll do a basic run with Henry. And they're going man. Watch that safety come down. Ooh, he's going over there. Ooh, get over there. Get over there. First down. Two. Two. So we got something out of that. Uh, let's go. Uh, let's just stay here and go curl flat. Let's see if Rhodes can hit a curl. They're doing that. I have Thomas go over the top just in case. We're going to cover one. Terrible throw. Another bad throw. Overshot that one. That's great defense right there, Brad. That's something I'm going to go back to a, just a basic option with Burks, and they're spreading out. Uh, I'm going to go to the left. Didn't get it. Dang it. We did not get that. 30 inches. I'm going to just try to run it with Henry. We're going man. Watch that safety come down. I told you. I knew he would do that. But we got the first. True, just enough. Uh, so we can try. He's gassed. Let's go with somebody else. If he's still kind of gassed. Uh, we can go here and do a basic run. I'm just trying to give Henry a bit of a break. I may need to switch out of formation with him. Ah, good, good defense. We're lucky we got the five yards that we did. I'm going to go from here. We're going to go halfback screen. And we're going man. I don't know if we got enough room to go over the top. Don't have to worry about it anyways. We'll go over here. 
bad throw. That's uh, Burks' first throw as a quarterback. I, I may just go back to this play right here. We're kind of in the middle of the field, so it's kind of tough to figure out what to go with. We'll go over here, just get up field. I, sh I could have pitched it right there, but I'm, I'm kind of glad I didn't. That gets us on the six-yard line. I think I'm gonna actually going to stay here. I don't think I got a. Do I got? I don't have halfback screen from here. We'll go back to screen. No, I know what we're going to do. We're going to go here. I'm going to go full back over. And of course, they got the impact guy on that side. I'm going to flip this thing. We're going to do something like this. And if this doesn't work, we're going to do a different play. Four, three, two. Ah, did not get in. That was a good effort. Not a bad play. Second and goal. We're going to do ISO with Henry. Just a completely different offense from last year. We're going to get a touchdown. Good deal. So at least we got on the scoreboard. Maybe we can just keep up with them. That would be great. And we're going to need a break or two on defense. That drive took forever, but we finally got down to the field and scored a touchdown. We're going to kick an extra point. And let's get on defense and figure out what to do there. I'm not really sure, other than I may... I'd like, I may try more cover two instead of cover one. I think once they get to the outside, that cover one gets eaten alive pretty badly. And maybe we need our safeties back there more to kind of protect those edges. Maybe. So let's try some of that this drive. As much as I'd love to blitz Krogstad all the time. So they're going two wide. Let's just go 4-3, cover two, man. Going ace normal. Quarterback play. They went that same thing again. It did not work, thankfully. I'm going to call the same thing. We're going to go back to cover two, man. Just keep everything in front of us. I fully expect a run here. Weak normal. I'm going to spread out like that. I, I can see them going to the edge, and they are. There we go. Somebody make a tackle. Nope. Make a tackle. Nope. Touchdown. Oh, well. So much for that game plan. Broken tackle. Broken tackle. And my strong safety just whiffed it, or whoever that safety. No, it's the safety right there. Just burnt. Oh, well, so back to offense we go. Our players are in the right position. We had them in the backfield. You just got to make the tackle, and it just didn't happen. So let's get on offense and try to get that touchdown back. We got two minutes to go. The ideal scenario would be go down the field, score before half, get the ball back in the third, and score again to tie it. Let's see if Thomas can do something on this one. Love to see some good blocking. Get a block there. Not a bad return. Gets us up to the 40. We're close to it. I'm actually going to call that a halfback play myself. I've been fooling around with this. It's going to be halfback pass. And they're going man, and they're going dime. This may not work at all. I may just run this with the with Henry. Yeah, we're just going to run it. He ain't going to get much out of it, but... We're going to get about six or seven yards. They went cover with one, too, so I couldn't go over the top. Second and three. We're actually going to stay here. I'm going to try play action just so I can maybe attempt to attack that safety. Let's see if this works. Cover two. Just good defense. Not the best throw. Third and three. Uh, we'll just stay here, I guess, and we'll go halfback screen. We'll go to Henry on this one. Go to him quickly. Just get a first down. Something like that. First and ten. I'm going to go here. We're going to go triangle. Going zone. Uh, he should be wide open over the middle. Good throw. Almost get a first down. I'm going to hurry this up, actually. I have no clue what they're running. 
Let's see what they're calling. They're going man. Good catch. Touchdown. We'll take it. Hey, if their corner is going to mess up and our free safety is going to mess up, then tip for tat. The problem is we score too quickly, but you can't control that. You know, what am I going to do? Just sit there on it, you know, at the one and just run clock. It's not worked in the second quarter. Fourth quarter, maybe, but... So they got a minute and a half to go, but at least we got on the scoreboard again. So pretty decent throw by Rhodes. We'll go ahead and kick an extra point. And I, I like to think they want to pass the rest of the way. I don't know if they want to do that, though. If I was them, I'd probably just run some more. Lord knows we can't stop their halfback. We need a fumble. We need a turnover is what we need. Not a very good kick. He's got some bodies to protect him, too. Somebody get a block. Uh-oh. There he goes. Shoot. Oh, well. Minute and a half, and they're about to score on us. I'll go cover two. Do something like this. Halfback toss works perfectly again, but it never works good for me. And my safety, just another goofed up. Golly. Just awful. It's embarrassing. We can't do anything right on defense today. Why does that work so well for the CPU and just never works for me? I mean, I would love to run toss more, but it always get blasted in the backfield. Look at that gaping hole. It's too easy. Another first down. Our entire front four, they're just getting gashed. Nobody's getting through. So it looks like they're going to give us maybe some time to score before half. I kind of wish they scored quickly, to be honest, but speed option touchdown. Just not, You can't stop it. Nothing you can do. So they're going to beat us by 40 or 50, if, unless I could just keep up with them and not make it look too embarrassing. I just skipped with the wrong team. That's another thing I never plan. I never look at these teams and see who I should go up against and whatnot. I don't think that's really fair. I just pick teams that just sounds good to me and just roll with it. But it looks like I picked the wrong team to go up against. Because, again, their offense, that's the perfect offense in 06. It's unstoppable if you got the right talent. Just run option with good backfield, and you just you can't lose. Let's see if Thomas can do something here. Nobody blocked. Minute eight. Uh, we can try get down the field, maybe. We're going zone. Hopefully Rhodes can make a decent throw here. Great throw. Good job to Thomas. We should have got a flag on that face mask. We'll go back to halfback screen. We're going man, I think. Yep, they're going man. Cover zero. Ah, that's intercepted. Game over. Game over, game over. And this is just a nightmare. My, my tight end stopped. Look, what's, look what he's doing here. He Why did he stop? Or the other guy just got in front of it. Man, just good defensive play. Just bad throw. Just bad everything. I'm going to try to keep my cool for the next 30 minutes, but it's going to be a challenge when everything's going perfectly for the other team. I'm going to do something like this. Is this another team i got to add to the schedule in the future to try to beat? Another good drag route. Can't stop that. Second and three. Uh, it don't matter what I call it. It's, the game's over with, so we'll just continue to do our one high stuff. The Buffalo come out in the ace formation. Play action's wide open over there. Third and one. Are they gonna hurry it up? They are. We need a stop here. Can we get a stop? Of course not. Of course not. Of course not. Just the most embarrassing thing ever. I can't believe I'm gonna post this publicly, but I, what do you do? You got to. I'm going to let him score. Like I said, it just don't matter now. The game's just told me I'm not going to have a chance today. Another option play, touchdown. I just... <laughs> I, what do you want me to do? <laughs> you know. 
Well, all right. So that's the third straight season we've lost that first game of the year. It's the per like I said, it's the perfect offense. If you want an easy road to national championships, that's the offense you run right there. So now it's practice mode the rest of the way from here. Now I'm just going to tinker with some plays and such because we can't come back from this. The game's going to have to give us some gifts, some turnovers or something. I just don't want to get embarrassed, and it's looking that way. Let's see if we can get something going here. Nope, nobody blocked that guy. 16 seconds. Uh, let's we can go option here. We're going zone. Perfect blitz on that run. Long bonds. And we didn't even get out of bounds. <laughs> Jeez, I got to call a timeout. Uh, we'll go receiving. We'll go slot post. We're going man. We're doing that. Cover zero. Can Marks make a play? Good catch. We'll call a timeout. Is it worth kicking a field goal? I mean, that just get it. I'm going to kick the field goal. I, I don't want to leave empty-handed. I don't know if my kicker can make this. It's first and ten. They're in the red zone. So Marks is having a pretty good game at least. Let's in kick a, a field goal and get down 18. Not a bad kick. I think it went through. All right, so at least we're only down 18. We get the ball back. Maybe we can get down 10 if I go for two. We can try that. If we get... Uh, oh, yeah. Let's go back and check out some stats. It's going to look really bad. 329 yards are rated for them. 284 yards rushing. Why? I don't even know why they're throwing the ball. There's no point in it. We can't stop their run game. And that's pretty much sums up the stats. You know, they're perfect on third down. They're just playing perfect football on offense. And I have no answer for it. Uh, Rhodes... I think he's doing fine, 147 yards, 6 for 9, a touchdown. Uh, Burks has the interception. Uh, I, that's not really his fault. I thought that safety or whoever done that made a decent play. So I'm not I'm not real overly upset about it, other than it just we got to turn over and they don't. That's what I'm more upset over. Uh, running the ball, it's okay. It's there, but when you're behind, it's just hard to run the ball more. Receiving, we kind of, you know, kind of spread the welfare defensively. Patrick. This is a problem. Your free safety is leading in tackles. That means your defense isn't playing well. Tackles for loss, just a few, not a single sack, not a single interception. So let's get back into the third quarter. If we score a touchdown, I'm going to go for two. Maybe we could get down 10. Let's see if Deloach can make something happen on special teams. Nope. Nobody blocked that guy. Uh, we can try. Uh, I think it's weak normal. Do I have it here? I'm looking for... I don't have it in this formation. I want to go after that safety again. I'm going to... Let's just try it from here. I think Burks is going to throw this one. It's a man defense. And they're double teaming him. Uh, I'm going to have Hall or Bale go over the top. But they're going to cover one. So we'll go to Johnson. Good throw. Burks' best throw of the day. Second and three. Let's go curl flat from spread. We're going man. Uh, we can try this maybe. Cover zero over the top, and I got hit when I throw it, and that's an interception. Just some, my left tackle got destroyed. Messed up the entire play, which has been pretty typical for us today. Third and three. Back to halfback screen maybe. Going man? Look, looks, I'm going cover zero. No, nope, they're going cover one. Double teamed. Why is he... I got to punt it. I got to. That was the only man beater I had. That was the perfect defensive play call. Like, I, it, it tears me up to no end when the, po when the CPU plays perfect. Like, they can't do anything wrong. Not a single thing. I'm like, surely they'll mess up at least once. Nope, not yet. Come on, just give me a bit of a break. Just something, anything, I'll take it. They got to play a hurt, but it doesn't matter. 
but until he shows we'll go cover up, two to play from behind. Yeah, I was to hear his another toss play and just five yards we'll go I, it don't matter we'll go cover one second and five coming up here ball right around midfield do something like this Triple option, and our, that safety's terrible. What's Patrick, he's having the worst day ever. Is that my free safety? He is just slowing down on every single play, it seems. There he is. He started for us last year. Why is he playing so bad? 85 overall, and he's playing like he's 65 overall. I'm shocked he got that tackle. All right, let's see what we can do here. Probably nothing, but another toss play that works perfectly. Gee, dang it, that burns me alive. Work for me. Why does I have to work for them every time? All right, back to cover one. Forgive me. I'm, I'm not going to apologize for being upset. No way. It just, it, it's obvious the game is just not going to help me out much at the day. Triple, and there he goes, and a face mask. We lucked out. That's our best play on defense today. We didn't get a face mask call. Let's go cover two. So we lost our advantage on in the third quarter because we couldn't convert. They come out with a big set. It don't matter. They're going to beat us anyways. It was just destined. Left guard destroyed me there. So that's third and four. We'll go cover one. And we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Do something like this, maybe. The most. High formation here. They're going to go option or option? I'm guessing they're going to go option. Toss play. Hey, we got a good stop, so maybe we'll force the field goal. Unfortunately, that just gains, that just extends their lead back to 21. So maybe we can get lucky on offense and get some touchdowns. He gets it up. And it is good. And now let's take a look we'll try. Them. I don't know what really the call, other than we just got to try to execute better. Everyone's all lined up. I guess I got to pass more. I mean, we don't, we're running out of time to have even a remote chance of, you know, keeping the close middle of the field. I'm letting that one go. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Not a whole uh, we'll go back here. Let's try that speed option play. We haven't called it yet. Arizona, Go over here. Nope. Perfect defense. Perfect, perfect defense. Golly. Just amazing pursuit. They knew what I was going to do before I called it. Let's go PA rollout, maybe. Let's see if we can take that safety. It hasn't worked once today. This is going with the see if Burks can make this throw. Cover two. Terrible throw. Another just... Third and forever. Oh, gosh. Just so frustrating. Just can't do anything right. Going zone. I don't know if Rhodes can make this throw. Cover two. Great catch. Good throw. Good enough. At least it gets us going somehow. All right. Uh, that's a five-yarder. We'll take it. I'm going to go here. We're going to try. Slam. Please don't. They're going 4 3. <laughs> Perfect defense call. Ah, oh, burn. It burns me up. Oh, at least that guy's covering the slot. We can get a field with Henry. From here, maybe we can try. He's gassed. Uh, we're going to go long bonds. We're going to do a counter. And they've got their guy on the strong side, so we're going to have to flip it. Don't know if it's going to work. Get a block or two. Nope, that, didn't, that wasn't a block. Get about eight yards at least. Not a bad play. Second and one. Henry still a bit gassed. We'll go tight end drag. Going man. Cover zero, but a sack. And they get 
Nobody blocked him. Nobody blocked him. So embarrassing. It's third and eight. Um, uh, got no choice. I gotta go deep bounce. We're going zone. This could be another difficult throw for Rhodes. Cover three. Good catch. Good throw, Rhodes. Good job. Keep it going. I'm gonna go option. We're gonna run to the right. Perfect defense again. Oh, Lee. Okay, and he's gassed. I can't go with him. I gotta take him. He's this formation sub with the halfbacks isn't working. We're gonna go put long bonds right there instead. Henry just can't handle it being out there for that long. Uh, let's go curl flat. Second and thirteen coming up. Going man. I'm gonna have the tight end go over the top. Maybe that'll help us. Just in case they're going cover one and a drop. I, I'm sorry. I don't know what you want me to do. <laughs> Nobody's helping me out today. Uh, let's try. Slot post. This will be another difficult throw. Rhodes is he's doing his part. He's making some difficult throws. Our receiver's gonna have to step up. That's intercepted. Uh, just perfect defense. There's nothing I can go through there. Fourth and third team. We got to go for it. We can't go for a field goal. We're not going to win on field goals. Going man. Cover one. Great catch and a touchdown. Shoot. Good job, Rhodes. Good job, Johnson. They stepped up. So now we're back down to two touchdowns. We're going to kick the extra point. Get us down two scores. And we got to figure out, we got to get lucky on defense. We need a turnover of some sort. Let's see if we can try that. What I may do is, you know, here's what I'm thinking. I may put Rhodes right here, and we're going to leave Burks just with one formation. We'll we'll just do option out of that or something, because right now I just don't know if it's worth it putting right there. Because we need Rhodes, we need to pass the ball some out of that formation, and Burks just doesn't have as good of an arm. So I think I'm going to do that. Everyone's all Burks will be fine with just one just one formation. I just need him to run just a little bit for us. I don't need him to throw as much. That's for sure. Rhodes is the better thrower. That's a so we got to stick with that. I still want to use Burks' leg somehow. Somebody make a tackle, please. All right. It's up to our defense. Can we get a stop or two? It's a miracle we're only down two scores. It really is. Let's see if we can play better going forward. Ah, just blew right by my defensive tackle. Dude weighs 100 pounds more than him. Boom, get off me, behemoth. I'm an impact player. You can't stop me. Uh, let's try another one high. I'm going to check his broken tackle that here in a minute. Quarterback. Make a play, somebody. That was a good throw. Good, I thought the receiver was going to catch that. Third and two. Uh, we'll stick with cover one. Gosh, can we stop him here? I don't know. This could be... Somebody needs to make a play. Left. Ow, get it, get it, get it. Ah, come on. He had to break a tackle, didn't he? That's just, he just had to break that tackle. This sums up the game. And I called the wrong play. Gee whiz. Do something like this. Just call the wrong play. Please don't have a big gain on me. Another toss play. Broken tackle, broken tackle, broken tackle, broken tackle. Come on. Give me something here. Jeez. It's just, it's nonsense. That's stupid. I'll, I mean, I'm more, I'm forgiving when it comes to impact halfbacks, but one. 
two, three. Ah, this stoop. It's all that is is stooping. Now I kind of get why people are upset, don't want to play 06s, but I get that. If you have to deal with that, just, just I don't want to call it unfair, but golly, it's unrealistic. My, my impact halfback, if I had one, it wouldn't do that. He couldn't. Not four broken tackles in a play. That's just whatever. That's just what you have to deal with, so let's see if we can get that touchdown back. Ah, oh, just so frustrating. All right, uh, middle of the field. Uh, I'm going to... We'll go back to halfback screen. Go in zone. We're going to have Rhodes use that formation now. Go over here. Perfect tackle. Spot on. Ace. We'll go halfback clear out. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 22 yard line. Go in zone. It's going to be another tough throw. Six DBs in the lineup. He's not open there. And I got it sacked. I, I'm just, I'm about to quit altogether. This is so stupid. My right tackle got destroyed. Nobody was open. Perfect defense. Look, there is nobody open. Who am I going to go to? I just, is it my fault I backed up too much? By then, it didn't matter. Say he already had the swim boot. I'm in a good spot right there. He was already going to come out regardless. And there's just nobody open. The halfback was going to get hit by that corner. It's just a complete cluster. Well, I tried my best, but the game just ain't going to help me out. So I'm going to try to get this quarter done as quickly as possible. Man, I hate games like this. It's so frustrating. Get it out of the way, I guess. At least it's not a conference game. Just stupid. All right. Let's go and... Try not to get embarrassed or some more. Oh, just beyond frustrating. Give me something. Give me something to be happy about. Nobody freaking block. Oh, dang it. Uh, I'm going to run clock the rest of the way. If it'll let me. Can I get a first down or two? Or am I going to get a fumble or something? They're going to blitz that linebacker right there. Just we can try uh, last stick maybe I'm running clock though again so it just is what it is so one thing I'm excited about why this thing is going because this game doesn't matter anymore is uh, I'm setting up some new membership stuff here really soon I'm really excited about that I've tried it a couple of times but I'm, I've done some studying and whatnot and I've had a couple of people ask me how they want a good way to support and I want to help them out with that Cover one. Ah, come on! Anything! Give me something to be to feel positive about my favorite game. Anything. Third and two. We'll go curl flat. Golly, I hate when you have games like this. It's just beyond awful. Terrible throw. Oh, well, I should have just ran, 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 and that's just my fault. Bad play, Colin. Like it matters. We're down 28 points, but I'm putting in my second string. I'm going, I mean, I'm not going to get anybody hurt. We got too many games left. Let's just, uh, I can't do, hold on. I can't do that. We don't have, well, we can try it. I got a couple spots where we're kind of hurting. For example, like free safety. Yeah, just... Gosh, just so sad. Another toss play. Look at that great blocking. Look at that. No, just you can't ask for anything better. Another nine-yard gash. Second and two. It's second down and two to go. Ball right around midfield. It don't matter what you call in games like this. The team's just going to, they're going to make their plays. The CPU's just going to do their thing. Their quarterback's humongous. Yes, run clock, please. I swear I'll run clock going forward. I just... 
Nobody, somebody do something, anything. Another first down. But going, I'm still going 4-3. I know it says no wide receivers, but they're probably going with that one. No, now they're going to go goal line. Now they tell me to do that. And this is going to be the first video of my membership that you can get early access. Don't know if anybody wants to watch it, but fumble. And they still get it. <laughs> it sums up the game perfectly. Look at this. It just sums up the game. Like, what are you going to do? Who's going to get it? I don't know. We're not going to get it because the game won't let us. Ah. Just, let's just have the games gone today. Hopefully it won't happen. But the problem is we got Texas coming up. That game's going to be even tougher. Unless they got a backfield that's not as potent as this one. Oh, geez. Good old 06. It's my favorite game of all time, but it's games like this make you want to throw things. Broken tackle. Short little game there. Just uh, clock running. Uh, we don't have the bodies for it, but we'll go one high to nickel. Off the field. It's third down and ten. Ball on the 46 yard line. Yeah, we don't have the bodies at corner. This is the first time I get to control a defensive end and go after the quarterback against a pass play. With the shotgun here. I probably should have called something different. It don't matter. The game's over with. So I'm not gonna waste a time out on something like that. Can't even get around the time. defensive end. Watch this throw. Look at this. <laughs> you gotta love it. Oh gosh, I just. If 07 didn't have the momentum meter, I would play it more. But that momentum meter just jacks up so many things. It mess. It get, causes way too many turnovers. Too many lopsided win games. It's just awful. Some people think there's a momentum meter in this game, but you've seen so many close games for me over the last few seasons. I, I just don't believe that. And we got to have another broken tackle. Good job. For a second and two, they're going to score again. Why did you have your best player out there still? Why is he out there? There's no point. He's had 300 yards rushing today. 300. Think about that. Next time, I'm going to just schedule teams that don't have something like this because it's just too frustrating. I hate to do that. I hate to scout teams based on who they have just so I can get more wins, but I don't... Another touchdown. I mean, I just... just it's just frustrating, but whatever. I'm going to take a knee the rest of the way. We'll, we'll go to the victory formation because I just want to get out of here. I'm tired of, I mean, getting embarrassed against two fronts. 59 points. They had 400 yards rushing, probably. Maybe. It's close to it. We'll just do that. I'm going to take a knee a couple times, and we're going to look at some stats, and I'm going to get really upset. Let's go QB Neal. Oh, geez. Do that. Do it one more time. So, yeah, I gotta, I'm got i going to do a membership thing. I know I've done it a couple times in the past. But it, it wasn't really very well thought out. Now this one, it has. I thought about it for a few days and how I want to plan it out. And I want to give people who really support what I do some extra cool perks and such. And that's just a good way to just support me in general. And the, it's it's going to be on YouTube, which makes a whole lot of difference. All right, final score, 100 million points to two. That's what it felt like today. Might as well, Ben. I think they had more broken tackles than we had points today. We're about to check it. We're going to get out of here quick. Campus challenge, I doubt we'll have many things going on here. It says we're getting some things, but it's just I never use them anymore. Let's go to stats. 490. I told you, 400 plus yards rushing. I told you, for almost 500 yards of offense. Our 332. When we weren't turning the ball over, I thought we were doing okay. But it don't matter if you can't keep up with them offensively. 
they didn't they weren't perfect on third down they only were 80 percent uh turnovers that one didn't go well for us nothing went well for us today let's go over to individual stats we're gonna go over to this halfback we're gonna go to rushing he had 300 yards four touchdowns and 15 broken tackles half of them were in one play alone where he just decided to run through everybody on our roster in one play and you count that and just uh, i'm not even gonna look all right let's go to passing i thought Rhodes. i thought he'd done fine that last interception that's not on him we just didn't get good protection burks's interception i thought that was just a good play by the safety uh running the ball uh, hindering and long bonds and then Burks. I think that's going to be okay in time. But when you're behind so much, you just kind of have to throw a bit more just to kind of keep up. And our passing game just didn't do well enough. Defensively, uh, our free safety uh, led in tackles, which again is never good. Tackles for loss, but not a sack, not an interception, just nothing. So let's get out of here. And let's go. I'm going to speed this up. And we're going to go. I'm not going to save it. We're going to go ahead and sim the week. So that really destroyed us in recruiting. Now I'm really worried to see how that's going to affect us. When you get beat so badly like that. Oh, man, just that halfback. Just, that's, it just gives you nightmares when you see stupid stuff like that. I wouldn't be upset about it if I was able to do the same thing, but you can't. I mean, even with an impact halfback of your own, you're not going to break 15 tackles in a game. Now let's go to the... Uh, Top 25 for the week. Let's talk uh, Virginia Tech, Ohio State, Auburn, UCLA. Then we got uh, Michigan. Purdue got upset. Or no, NC State got upset, I should say. Uh, West Virginia got upset. Miami won. Iowa. Vanderbilt is ranked. Good for them. They're doing something, right? We're not. Uh, Stanford won. LSU. Uh, Florida. Nebraska. Oregon State. Oklahoma. And I'm going to go to recruiting. I know this video is getting a little overpassed, but I'm just curious. So we're doing fine with strong safety. And look, Richard, we move up big time, 25 points. At least we are not getting hurt by that loss. We went up for the middle linebacker, up for the halfback, and we're staying steady at the top spot with the tackle. So even with that terrible loss, recruiting is looking very good. So if there's any silver lining to any of this, the loss did not hurt us in recruiting. So let's go back in our next game. We get the mighty Texas Longhorns. I'm scheduling them every year until we beat them. Maybe it's this year. I don't know. I think Vince Young is finally gone. Hopefully they don't have another dual threat quarterback that'll just run right past us all the time. But they got more talent than we do. They're 1-0. Looks like they're pretty good at everything. I don't know who they played in their first game. Uh, but either way, it's going to be another uphill battle, and it's on the road. Let's just hope for the best, and maybe we can pull off the upset. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.